I think tonight losing was probably a blessing for us, for me personally, to see and say, you know, this player is not going to make it right now. That one's not going to make it right now. That one's not going to make it right now. And when we start developing our players and communicating with our under 23 and under 20 coach, we know we're looking for. That's when they're going to come up. So you know, it was a, it was a good it was a good exercise tonight in that respect. Obviously, I hate losing. I hate losing. I don't want to lose, you know. But um, sometimes you can't just uh, sacrifice certain things. Sometimes you've got to be bold enough to stand up and say, if I lose, it doesn't matter. I could have been in a situation if I say, OK, it's a FIFA weekend. Let me keep all the international players, uh, overseas-based players, that come here and play Zimbabwe and win 3 or 4 no. Then we're still not going to be in the same position that we are right now. Right now, we're in a much, much better position. I think not only me, but a lot of people will see. Hang on a second. Some of these guys are not ready yet. You know, they've got to keep working a bit harder. Uh, if I brought the overseas-based players and we came out here today and beat Zimbabwe 3 or 4 no, the question would have been, well, why don't we put the youngsters in? Let's put the youngsters in, let's get a chance to see them. So I did that tonight because I really wanted to see them. You know, I've got to try and get a team for the Kasafa Cup. But um, as I say, I'm not, that, uh, I'm not that disappointed because I saw a lot of things tonight. But what we've got to do, we've got to do it slowly because we're not going to, it's not going to happen overnight where you can just put 10 or 8 players in there. Uh, that are, some of them are making their debut, some of them haven't been involved, some of them just not at, at this level yet, and, and continue going. We've got a responsibility to make sure that we... we introduce them slowly and you know you can introduce two at a time one two at a time but keep the bulk of the team and slowly but surely you bring in one you bring in two you bring in one you bring in two and they're playing around players like KG like Dean Furman like Makocha and all of a sudden their level will also raise unfortunately some of the players some of their levels never raised today because some of the players around them weren't maybe on the same page and it was it was just it wasn't wasn't much tonight you know if uh, if you take one player or two of these players that played tonight and put them in the team that i had on sunday uh, against botswana you would have noticed them so much as, as as what they did tonight tonight a lot of players looked totally out of it looked looked just that the level was just too high for them